Today we have a very special presentation. We're at the Sangha Hall in Hilo. We're presenting a fish for the holidays for the participants of Project Dana. Project Dana means selfless giving. And they're here to recognize, honor our elders. And today we have a special 10 pound opaka paka. And we like to say mahalo to Jared Miyake and Ted Fuji who caught this fish. We have a 10 pound opaka paka that Mr. Kurisu prepared. Okay. And everybody's going to have a piece to taste of this opaka paka. But Mr. Kurisu, would you mention a few words? Okay, thank you very much for inviting us. And actually, I came here to thank you folks because uh, it's Thanksgiving um, lunch eh, today, yeah? And uh, we are very, very grateful for all what you guys have done for us as young, younger people. We learned so much, so no more arigato. We're very, very grateful for all that. Um, I cleaned up Paka Paka and I, I want to make sure that no more bones. So what I did is that I filleted the fish, took all the meat out, cook them, and put the meat back so that no more bones are that. Let's see how this thing tastes. Mm. 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 Oh, my God! So they were not them oysters, yo. Hey, here I have uh, Mr. Sakamore. You know, he used to uh, uh, raise for us all our Moyashi at KT, and now the son took over, right? You're my Moyashi guy, worked for Mika. I knew him for such a long time. Mr. Sak Mr. Sakamoto, you're over 90 now. 97. 97! I cannot believe that. Hey, so I want you to take, take a, um, taste my fish and see how good it is. How's that? Try to taste that fish. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. If I have smell a fish in me, I wouldn't come down. <laughs> I don't have it. How is hey. it? <laughs> All right, Mr. Sakamoto, and A like that. Right? Okay. Yeah. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yeah. Very nice, very nice. Hey, right, here we have Mrs. Miwa, man. You know, yeah, this is Project Donna uh, luncheon is unreal. It's for Thanksgiving. You got all that turkey. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, now I want you to taste my fish, the one I made. Come on, can you taste it? Very delicious. Oh, oh. very delicious. Mmm, huh? very. Very, okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> hey, yeah, Mrs. Wono over here. Mrs. Wono, hey, um, how you how's the fish? Does it taste good? It's very good. Very good. Very good. Okay, that's sakana wa oishi, eh? Yeah? Oishi, oishi. <laughs> <laughs> ah, thank you very much. At Hilo Honganji in between, you know, there's so many great leaders over here. They're doing so many great things uh, uh, for all the members and, and also for the community. And here he is, hey, Karen Maedo. So Karen, first of all, what is Dana Day? Project Dana is a time for us to pay thanks to all those oldsters and shut-ins who cannot otherwise get together. Wow. So. Fantastic. So what, what motivates you and all these volunteers to um, unselfishly give up your time and energy and, and everything else? I had very little to do with it, frankly, but there are many volunteers who come in every month uh, rotating to cook for these people and pick them up and give, an op give them an opportunity to socialize amongst each other, which is, of course, the most important thing. And when I get old, I'd like that opportunity, too. Yeah, young girl, yeah, that's right. You know, yeah, but uh, thank you for all what you guys are doing for the community here. Thank you. We cannot pay back these people, you know. We're just glad that they're here to enjoy what we can share with them. Awesome. Thank you very much. Gokigeyo, sayonara! <laughs> the island of Hawaii is such a special place. It is where people help each other and work together as family. This is what Christmas is all about. It is about giving to make a difference for others. Here is Sherry Fox singing Silent Night and White Christmas dedicated to all of you. Silent night, holy night, all is calm, all is bright, round yon virgin mother and child.
throughout the year. It is refreshing to see so many who sacrifice their precious time and resources to put a smile on the faces of others. Yes, this experience of making others happy is a priceless experience which makes an average day into a fantastic day. Thank you all, and yes, we need to keep on performing good deeds because this is what makes living here on the island of Hawaii so great. Christmas gift doesn't have to only be materialistic, but could be a gift of helping others. So do something special this holiday season. Get into the spirit of loving and helping others. George and I, we want to wish you a safe, happy holiday season. Today we are at the Lyman House Museum in Hilo. We are attending a real special class. Uh, it, it's an arts and crafts class in making paroles. And it, it's a Filipino cultural kind of thing where they make these ornaments to celebrate the Christmas season. Today, our instructor is Lito Asuncion, my good friend, and his wife, Millie. Okay, and here's Lito Asuncion. Lito, tell us, uh, how you pronounce parole? Parole. Parole. You, oh, get, you, you gotta have that rolling R. Parole. Yeah. Parole. Yeah. parole, okay. Yeah. Parole. And that's what you have here? This is what I have. This is just the frame, uh, initial stages for making the parole, yeah? I see. Yeah. And, and then the Filipinos celebrate this every Christmas? Every Christmas. and. Uh, in uh, every school, actually, they, they teach the kids to make this in uh, elementary grades so that they can get them ready just before the holiday seasons to hang. Okay, this is supposed to be hung in the house, outside? Yeah, it's usually outside, but it can be hung inside, though. It, it depends if you have uh, rain, it, uh, strong rains and things like that, but it could be used in the house also. I see. Uh, and the symbol of this is what? To bring good luck, to celebrate? What, what is it's, it? It's basically Christianity. Yeah? It signifies the the, uh, the star of Bethlehem or oh. yeah, so that the, supposedly the three kings can find Jesus mm -hmm. and it, it symbolizes Christianity. One final question here. Yeah. Uh, are you supposed to hang only one or you can hang in and out? And you can hang as many as you want and yeah. you can and decorate them. Uh, you can be creative in yeah. any way you want them to be, different colors. and It's, uh, it's a very creative activity for most yeah. people. And can be any size? Any size from wow. 6 inches to even 2 feet. 
Yeah. 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 Hey, I'm so excited. So you, okay. I'm going to make one today, you know, Lito. Right, yeah. Hey, Lito, I make, I make this one. Pretty good, George. Pretty good. <laughs> hey. Hey. Yeah. Hand. Only three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> but from here, I'm going to put all my own, deco you know, individual oh, yeah. decorations, mm -hmm. yeah? And it, you can be creative, as creative as mm -hmm. you want, mm -hmm. uh, different colors if you want. Mm -hmm. Hey, we're talking to some of the participants here at the workshop. Your name, please, ma'am? Marty Morishige. Morishige is a nice Caucasian name there. <laughs> but uh, how are you enjoying yourself? Oh, I'm enjoying myself a lot. This is great. I'm enjoying making something for Christmas. Is it fun? Yes, it is. Because, uh, you know, to make something like this and uh, then later on display it, it's going to be exciting. And next we have... Carol Jaglinski. And that's a good Japanese name, <laughs> if you tell me. So how are you enjoying yourself? Very much. This is something I wanted to learn for 40 years, so finally. Why? I, I lived in the Philippines for two years. So you encourage all your friends to come out for classes like this? Yes, yes. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, this is my friend Barbara, Barbara Moyer, and your title here? I'm the Curator of Education and Operations for the Lyman Museum. Hey, thank you so much for bringing such a class to the community, Barbara. We are very, very proud to be able to do this, hopefully just before every Christmas, because the community really wants workshops like this, and especially the Parol workshop, because it's just in time for Christmas. Yeah, you know, um, besides this, this class, throughout the year you have different kind of special workshop? We do. In fact, in early December, we have another workshop for learning how to make and actually making Ni'ihau shell lei and Ni'ihau shell bracelet and earrings. So we're going to be offering those workshops on December 3rd and 4th. But we also offer other workshops throughout the year. And also tours. And tours. Yeah, and all seniors are invited to come down here. Absolutely, and they get a reduced rate. Wow. <laughs> Okay, thank you so much once again. Can we wave to the camera and say Merry Christmas, everybody? Mele kalikimaka.